So this is supposed to be where the Creator create a sweet net people here. This is the whole scene is a secret area. And the fourth secret mountain represents east, south, west, north. One of the mountains stand for the man, one for the female. Mela River, which is the Colorado River. And the one on the east side is a female river. Earth is a represent for the mother. The sky is a represent for the father. Everything is go by pray with. So even we talk to our children like that, they know how to pray too. And we have earth around here to heal with. Medicine men here to heal us too. If he sound or pray to the tree, to the water, to the air, to the earth. We have freedom because this is Indian, belong to Indian land. And we use the wool from the sheep, make it into different color. You set up loon, sit by and pray. They come to you right away. You know how to design what it means. And then you start it from there. This over here, this is the place to pray. Sing a sacred song. <laughs> faced with um, forced relocation so that the corporation that is mining this land can um, expand its uh, companies for massive um, electricity production. There is no greater satisfaction or one that gives our lives better and greater meaning than the sacrifice of causes greater than our self-interest. Causes that encompass us not defined by our personal ambitions alone. America stands for something so much greater than the cynicism that sometimes afflicts us. We stand, as we always have, for freedom and justice for all humanity. And I am so proud, so proud, that this message has struck a chord in the hearts of so many Americans of every race, creed, and political persuasion in this vast and diverse country. That's the reason why we, we don't believe those are man-made laws. Our groundwater is being drained out to move this uh, coal that is being strip mined from these lands, depleting the only drinking water source in the region to generate electricity in the southwest. Messing up Mother Earth's heart. We don't have running water, nothing, but that's okay. We know how to live. No matter how much we protested and tried to speak on behalf of our way of life and our culture, we were not listened to. And Let my people live. We're not criminals. We're not trespassers. We want the world to know and we want to appeal to you. I'll continue to come out here as, uh, as long as the, uh, the elders are here, and, uh, and uh, I'll resist you know, with all my strength. They're unable to grow their cornfields, and they would traditionally. It's a killing, killing law. We've also uh, come and helped elder, elders plant corn, uh, ones that were unable to. I heard the grandmothers, a lot of elders needed help. And now I'm here because I want to stop this genocide. They destroy the people. If they go on and go on to kill people, to kill the soil, the ground, it will come back to us. The lawmaker, these are crazy people. They don't have no brain, no heart, no nothing. That's all I can say today. Thank you.